Welcome back everybody to Farming Simulator 22 here on Western Wilds. It's not as wild as it needs to be. Well, I don't know. Y'all take the guess of that. I'm just looking over here making sure I got all the sticks and and, and, and uh, whipper snapper beating things out of the way. Well, I had one almost fell off and whipped me upside the head. I'm like, what the... Anyway, I hope y'all are doing good. I'm just making that up, folks. I didn't get hit. But, uh, yeah. Welcome back. Uh, I put a few things in. This thing here, I can hit B. And it'll take and push. Oh, a little leg. Uh, all the pallets down. And I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to take this in here and show y'all. Oh, there's two. Ooh, ooh, two pallets of furniture. Oh, my. I made to cut that out. Anyway, as I was uh, inter oddly uh, uh, interrupted by my uh, fire radio, uh, this is going to be turned the other way, of course. Let me see if we can turn it real quick. Well, it probably won't be quick, but it's going to be sitting here like this. And a lot of people will come in here and deactivate the factories and stuff. If you got. See, I don't have a pallet that's fixing spawn, so I don't have to worry about cutting it off and stuff. So uh, you just hit B. Um, oh, okay. There it goes. And that pushes it right there until some more gets in and then come in here and push it. I don't know if this thing's automatic or not. I don't think it is. Move pallet pusher enter vehicle enter. Oh, well, I'm too close to the port. But anyway, y'all get the hint. Now we need a. Uh, I need to turn shoot the strength on it to help pick these up better and pick them up from a distance too. Uh, I'm gonna need a storage place for these, but for right now, nobody comes in the back door except for the workers, and, and they can walk around. Uh, I thought about putting something up over here, maybe, because I also thought about putting some greenhouses over here. Maybe. I uh, gotta get that sprayed first. But anyway, I got purple one. Oh, hang on a second. Anyway, I, I'm back. I thought that was my daughter getting off early. I'm like, I just dropped her off for work. I'm already getting rid of her. <laughs> oh. But anyway, yes, all the stuff is up and out of the way. And you're probably like, Mr. Blue, there wasn't white lines there last time. No, folks, they came in. I had them paint some white lines on here. I'm like, uh, yeah, what if we get cars? Where are they going to park at? And I'm like, um, it's a lumber mill. All right, people can still come in here and do business, right? Right? Anyway, we'll go in here and see. We're almost filled up with planks on on this thing. Whoa, what was that? Okay, I guess it changed. That's the wrong one anyway. Planks was almost full. That, that can't be right. But we got 54,000 liters of wood in here. You know, trees do make furniture. I, I didn't know that. And you go down to the planks, they make 70, where the oven makes 45. So we should be getting double outcome here. Um, it is the no handcuffs mod. Uh, I can't remember the monitor. There's no handcuffs. I'm just searching and find it. If not, I'll try to find a link for you. Does it let me know? And the wood mill, no planks yet, but it's it's got 97,540. And uh, and climbing. I'm gonna show y'all back here. Jump over here. Um, we ripped the bushes out for these people here, except for that one there. I actually think they forgot it. I'm not for sure. But uh, trees are gone down through here. We do have to rip the bushes out. But um, heh, our property line goes right here, folks. So, uh, yeah, they wanted the trees gone. So we got rid of them. Uh, just cost them, you know, for the wood. That's all we needed. And, uh, yeah, so when we get the money, we're going to have a road put in back here. It's a small road where a semi can come through here and turn, pick up our pallets. Might have some greenhouses, like I said, on this side down through here or some kind of production, something like that. 
So yeah, but anyway, we got a load of logs right here to sell, as you can see. Look at the crazy mess. See, that's why I call them funky trees. Look at the collision boxes on these. They're so wide in certain places. That's why I call them the funky trees. And you see we're actually losing money because uh, I thought that was 7.15 when I first started. Now it's 7.08. Um, here's our spray rig. We'll get to that here in a second. I'm going to go ahead and get this tractor started. And folks, once I get to the lumber yard, I will show you the profit. All right, we are back up here. Oh, whoa. A limb sticking out that far, folks. See right here? I can't go no further. Collision on a limb. Been hanging me up every tree I hit. Which is pretty often. All right, we got, oh, what is this? We got 11,700 so wood and $117 environmental score income. Woohoo! Brings us up to 12,000. Can't beat that, folks. Can't beat that at all. I'm gonna. All right, I'm gonna come in here. I'm gonna create job. Um, I don't know. Let's see. Go to. Really, we don't have nothing else over here for him to get. Um, so I'm gonna hang loose with the trailer. I'm gonna go ahead and take the trailer back to here. Hopefully, that won't run over anything. There he goes. I'm gonna, I'm gonna hop out, let him go. We're gonna jump over in this guy. Or I say this guy every time. I, I mean this tractor. I don't know why I do that, folks. I just do it. Miller's sawmill. Ooh, hoo, hoo. Oh, it's a perfect name for that sawmill. Considering my last name's Miller. Get it, get it, get it, get it. All right, now this is what we're going to do. Uh, let's go on around to the far corner over here. I'm going to go ahead. I don't think I have to pull any pins or anything. I'm going to go ahead and start unfolding. Oh, my, I need to slow that down a little bit. Oh, my goodness. Why I'm glad I got GPS. Oh my goodness. Um, um, okay. I was sorry to say. This tractor is supposed to have GPS. Uh, control S. I think. You'll be here. I'm going to go north. And then back. I'm going to hit all the way up 131. Woo. Woo hoo hoo. That's what I'm talking about. Okay, it's got, it's got it set. It looks like it's wider than that. That's about right. That's lined up there. And that one's lined up on that line. Um, what I'm going to do, I'm going to start across here first. And this thing is so weird backing it up with the turn axles and stuff. I don't, oh wow, okay. Getting it all up on the shed and everything out. This this gonna be good enough I guess. It's Mon Mace Blue. John at the dealership got with his friend and mixed me up some special special stuff. I'm just trying to see yeah. because uh, a lot of times you can raise up the boom and stuff all we can do is just raise and lower the big thing he did say take it all the way down all the way down to the ground i don't know who that was somebody takes me but anyway we're going back up and get straight here we'll do across the end all right we are on now I'm just pretending to do this. Um, it's not actually spraying because we don't have a field made yet. But what we're going to do, it's going to be uh, killing all these bushes out so we can mow. Alright. 
turn it off. I'm gonna raise the bad boy up. And about right there should be about right. We're going to reset this. And we're gonna bring it over this way just a little bit. We're gonna lock on. We're gonna go to town. Uh, about lower this down. Want this high enough. Don't want to knock no uh, wrong way. Don't want to knock no tips off of it, but we do want to get everything sprayed. So he said, raise it up in the thick parts so to go over. And if you see any of them lower than what it's supposed to be, drop it back down. So that's what I'm doing. I was actually hoping I could use. Oh wait, I can probably. Hang on a second. I'll be right back. All right, I thought I could deactivate the app auto application rate and it would start spraying, but it, it doesn't. All right, we're turning off there. I shouldn't be driving on the neighbors, but... Whoa, not that way, this way. Plus, this gives us a chance to, to check us out. I just wish it was actually using the... Uh... Like I said, I'm not using this right, folks. I'm just pretending to be spraying these scrub brushes here or whatever they are and just to get rid of them you know pretend we're, we're getting rid of them by the spray and uh yeah because some of the weeds are still being here what i'm gonna do is take the train tool go over it and get the the, the, the these bushes right here out of it and just pretend the spray work you know maybe uh by this evening or something they'll be gone and tomorrow we can come in here and actually uh, mow this. So next episode we'll probably be mowing. So yeah, you know, just a little imagination. Ain't nothing wrong with that, right? A little imagination to get the the nation going, or <laughs> I don't know. I have no idea. Uh, I'm tired. But well, I figured I need a video for Friday, so y'all should be watching this on Friday. So TGIF. Y'all don't know what that means. That means thank God it's Friday. Um So yeah, my plans is, you know, we're gonna mow this. Um today we really need to plant cotton today. So I'm gonna go ahead and pretend I'm gonna go over this and uh bring y'all back here in a little bit with uh, a cotton planter and something like that and uh yeah we're gonna see what we can plant hopefully wish there was a way of slowing this fold up down or, or only folding parts of it ah no i can't turn the sprayer on right now Anyway, I'll be right back, folks. All right, I'm down here checking the greenhouses, making sure with no extra pallet that I need to move out of the way. As you can see here, our strawberries are getting a pretty good collection. Three, six, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18 pallets of strawberries. We got two, four, six of lettuce, and then we got, uh, let's see here. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten pallets of uh, uh, tomatoes. So, uh, it, it's March. I'm going here real quick while it's saving. And I want to show you some. Uh, you see cotton right here. Um, well, hang on. There's my mouse. Uh, over here, February, we're on cotton. You can see this is dark this is light I don't know if it makes a difference but this is light and this is dark okay this is cotton where we see we plant in the dark darks here we plant in the light light is here so when we plant cotton right now it's going to come off on the light one I think it's something we can go by which that should be right because February we, we plant them early they harvest early we plant them late they harvest late right so color to color that'd be right we can't plant that in November nothing except grass that's 
about all we can plant. So anyway, um, yeah, I do want to plant cotton, but first we gotta. I think I, I might have let it go to the next episode because this grass is a little bit more important. Uh, cotton, I know what we can do. Oh no 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 no, fo fo! Oh, I killed the tractor. Nah, here, no. Um. Ooh. Okay. I was on a, I guess I hit it and then, uh, I don't know what it done, but anyway, it was the wrong one. We're going to turn the front one on, we're going to pull it forward a little bit, then we're going to switch to the back one and let it down. Yeah, we're going to go across this strip here first, then we got a couple strips there. We are not going to tend this. That's it. Those things raise up. I just wish I could remember how to let them down. Hmm. Oh, well, it's got to be some kind of... That's the door. I, I guess it's interfering with the door, probably. The only thing I can think of. Oh, my God. All I had to do was push down. Toggle work mode. I see it now. It wasn't there before. Okay, I'm gonna bring all this into the middle. That should be the middle. Okay, we're gonna turn it on. Yeah, there we go. Back up this a little bit. And yeah, we're going. Oh yeah, look at that. That's a lot better. It's easier to bail that way. But folks, um, yeah, it's March. We need to plant cotton. We need to get the grass done. The grass fur won't take that long. Um, oh, okay. I was going to say, it should be you stopped mowing. It did. So we got a little extra there. Probably won't be able to pick this, what we just got off. But, uh, oh well. But a lot of farmers mow around their crops and stuff. And so, uh, yeah. We're we'll mowing around our wheat. The other guy over there is catching all get out of trouble because uh, well, this because 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 okay we're gonna shut that off raise them up I'm just gonna uh, bow there we go just gonna mow down through here a couple times with the front mower. I guess it's still mowing, looks like it. That needs to be a little bit wider. Alright, looks like we can get by with it now, so we're gonna go ahead and let this down. Folks, I'm gonna go ahead and mow this, and I will bring y'all back here in a little bit. Uh, we don't have nothing else grass, so uh, turn them on. This only thing we got grass, so I think Besides that one field, we gotta wait on it get ready. So I'm gonna mow this, and then I'm gonna go get the planter. So be right back. All right, we're back in the shop, working on our tractor. Uh, this is what John uh, dealership had in stock for wide tires for this tractor. So uh, customized, uh, zero dollars. He said, "Don't worry about it. They came with the tractor. Just forgot to tell me." I'm like, "Well, I'm glad we stopped by." But anyway, let's check them out. I like them, folks. I really do like them. Yeah. All right. Let's uh, get this bad boy started here. Make sure nobody's behind us. But uh, I will meet you. We're going to take this and get it hooked up to the baler. Uh, I don't think the other tractor can has enough horsepower for it so uh not the big tractor we're gonna keep it on the mower oh man it's rough through here oh a lot smoother than what it was with those singles though or narrows i should say i'll be right back all right our shop's getting kind of bare getting all this equipment out all right well we got all that hooked up oh my god this thing needs a bath not now 
they'll have to wait till later. Uh, I gotta, let's pull up here, get this automatic door to open. I'm out. Yeah, there we go. I'm gonna look at something real quick in here. Um, used vehicles for sale. Ooh, look at that. Tachi, yeah. yeah. Oh my goodness, we got a lizard cab over. 14,000. We got, oh, combine. We got a service truck for 26. Folks, <clears throat> let me make a phone call. I gotta make a phone call. Be right back. All right, we was at 480,000, folks. We gonna borrow 20,000, make it 500, even what we owe for the bank. Uh, let's get out of there. Uh, reason four, I, I told, I told, uh, what's his name? I don't know what's his name. I, I, I can't remember right now. But I told him about this truck I want. You know, it's pretty good, decent looking uh, <laughs> lizard. Looks like a, a, a peat. Actually, I don't know what the cab overs are. We, we want to go with uh, a peat. Uh, Jordan. Uh, my cousin Jordan, if you're watching this, or Jason, do they make cab overs and peat? I'm pretty sure they do. Um, okay, we got a bunch of designs here, and oops, I'm on. Okay, tires. Uh, this is going to raise the price, but uh, we're just going to go through here and see what's the options. Look at the back tires. Not very many options. Okay, just those. Um, standard two. It's just changing the front. It's changing the hubcap. Looks like three. Um, standard three change the frame. Uh, can I zoom out? Uh, we don't want to go that much. That's already twenty-four thousand there. Uh, Fifteen thousand here. So we're gonna go back to standard one. Um, uh, deflectors and stripes. Um, nope, I don't like those things. We're basically gonna keep it like it is for right now. What is that the bumper? Yeah, we'll just keep it like it is for right now. Sun visor, mud guards. And we might need mud guards. Oh, that's the front ones. Exhaust. Dual exhaust. Hmm. That adds a thousand to it. Where did we get the other? I thought it was twelve something. Did I change anything? All oh, that zero. I'm back out. Oh, it was fourteen thousand. Okay, never mind. All right, let's go to Zal's uh, engine. Eighteen speed, fifteen speed. Three seventy-five. Three fifty. That's going down. Boy, there's a four. Three thirty to four thirty. Let's do 18 speed, 430 horsepower, GPS, no, we don't need GPS, that's probably why it was higher, I don't, don't say, is that just a, no, it's not a main color, we want to have them change the color for sure, um, to blue, oh yes, zero dollars at that, uh, design, uh, white. Let's change this to pink. Oh, 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 no, oh, oh, no, 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 no. Um, and we go to a different blue, New Holland. Well, that didn't change to what I thought it was. Ram color, license plate. Okay, we're going to keep it like that. That's 14654 We're going to buy it. Yes. Okay. 
Yeah, front loader. I don't, well, of course, we don't need a front loader. A trailer would come in handy. But now, 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 we gotta get out of here. Uh, I'm gonna turn this back. I, I gotta check on something real quick. That's what I was gonna do in the first place. Um, they go to the stuff that I own. Own the items. Here we go. Um, tether wrapper, bell wrapper, right here. 125 to. That's round bells. Square bells is 220. So 220 is highest we can go up on the bells. It was set to 220. Get that pop back up there. It's right there. Um, by the back of the thing here, you can see L. It says change bell size 220. Yeah. Um, current bell is 16. We want to reset the bell. Control Alt and Y. Control Alt and Y. Zero bells. All right. Uh, like I said, these are going to be wrapped. Oh, missing some already. There we go. Oh, didn't get it. Get it? Yep, there we go. Alright, yeah, it's a little bit wider than it's supposed to be, but. Is that set to 220? Yeah, okay. I both have a, a different bell thing in here to make the bells a lot bigger, but I don't see that nowhere, so. But anyway, folks, uh, we are running out of time. It's already 30 minutes, so I'm going to go ahead and do all this off screen y'all have seen it done before and plus we have a whole lot bigger a bigger uh, field to do in a, after we plant cotton I should have done that better oh we got two logs there I, I forgot about actually we can go through here and cut these logs or trees that's standing right here because you come on down here get out here a little bit further get some of this hey drop these bells across and oh crap as you can see I went went down there uh, I, I, I can pick up some more grass down through here turn my lights on so I can see better one two three uh, I don't want to get the uh, wheat there oh gotta scoot over you can see I have to scoot over it about here to get all that picked up because that's about where my passenger or yeah passenger no driver front wheel it'll be driver's front wheel that is where the bounty bounty line is a boundary line I'll get out here in a minute hey because they drop way down here I'm gonna go ahead and drop these other two get over turn it on that way I can grow across this end again hopefully yeah there we go it dropped there so I can go ahead and make this a little bit wider and I'll come back and get those other pieces there here in a minute and yeah we're going to be planting cotton in the next episode for sure I, I don't think we can do it folks it's already unless y'all want a long long video because I'm going to get this done so I'm going to bring you on back I'm going to hurry up and get this done bring y'all back with a bail count total and um, yeah see what else we can do real quick to end the video so I'll be right back all right folks let's see how many bells we got square bell 220 on the size we got 20 of 24 which is a hundred and twenty thousand liters of so sullage salage how y'all say it me and big daddy was wondering about that is it sullage or salage i can't remember which way he said they said it up there but down here i've heard both ways you, you go a little bit more south you, you hear it one way and you go a little bit more north and you hear it the other way yeah sullage or salage all right now it's fragmenting uh there's six thousand liters uh, what I say 20 let's, let's get back in uh, Baylor here and we have current bail is 20 um, 
start the tractor. Turn the back. Nope, we can't do it that way. I know. We can go this other. Oh my god, all the reds. Red, red, red construction calls. New vehicles. Yeah, 500,000. Um, should be. Probably this one. Nope, that one. Yep, uh. Uh, bales, 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 bales. Bales produce. Season 20. Total is 120. So, okay, so we done 20. 20 bales off that field. That is not bad, folks. That is not bad. Yeah, I thought one of them was still running. We got the tractor with the mowers. We got the baler. We got a wrapper with no tractor. Yeah, you gotta have a, a three point or two point hitch on this at least. Uh, pickup truck couldn't hook up to this trailer because the hitch was different. Yeah, so uh, we need another tractor, folks. Uh, having said that, let's go check out stuff before we leave here because it's probably um, next time y'all come, next episode will probably be. March the second. Do we still have time to plant cotton? March the second. Oh, by the way, our sheep, our bass. As you can see right here, they're 14 months, 450, 125 one month, one month, 125, 125 one month, uh, 450, 14 months, 14 months, 450, 14 months, 450. One month, 125. So we had two, four, six, eight. Now we got two, four, six, eight. So basically, yeah. Yeah, that's how many. We got two black, whatever it is, uh, at one month old. So that's two, four, six, eight babies. And we had eight, or uh, two, four, six, eight sheep. Yep. So each sheep produced a sheep. Yeah, but anyway, this thing next year, all that's going to double. It's going to double, folks. Um, currently, uh, cotton, that would be good if we had cotton. Eggs, uh, we don't have no eggs. Olives, canola oil, we don't have none of that stuff, folks. Um, but yeah, uh, let's see here. We owe 500000 that we know. Um, I want to check out the furniture. Um, now this is March. It's right there. Up here is 24.15, okay? Um, train yard is still high. If, if, if I don't know if that's showing March's price right there or if it's just showing the highest price because it used to have a white line across here and it was that price so I don't know that's supposed to be the lowest that's supposed to be the highest but it's showing the highest at train yard for furniture planks um, all right I'm gonna have to go my daughter says she's getting off in about 15 minutes and it takes about 20 to get there so but anyway y'all see the prices and stuff and I forgot to show you the gold. Um, gold March it's down, but the highest price is five five thousand five hundred, and it's not quite there. So it's not the highest price, and it's going down. Uh, it'll be July before it'll be up. So we can wait a couple months on it. Uh, I think I done pass all the others, but folks. Uh, what I want to do is right here. We can plant cotton tomorrow, but it needs to be early. I think we'll plant it in the next episode. What we'll do, we'll come on next episode, plant the cotton, fast forward to the next day and see what goes on. But I gotta show off our beauty real quick. We're gonna get a trailer for it. I'm gonna look around, see if John gets a. a I love how the cab rises. 
air suspension cab. Do we have a hitch on the back? It may pull that one trailer. Not, not going to look out. Nope. Crap, I got to get something down here. I'm gonna do. But anyway, let's look inside. Oh. Hey, Jordan. You want to drive this truck? I want to take a picture of just this. For the thumbnail. Anyway. Uh, thank each and every one of y'all folks for watching and stuff. Oh, that's my fire chief now. Both of them call or text me. Oh, lordy. Uh, anyway, I appreciate each and every one of y'all. Y'all have a great day, folks. I love y'all. And uh, y'all have a great day. A blessed day. And I'll see you in the next episode. Bye.